Shalom and welcome to Tov, the Jewish news channel. With us today we have Dr. Eddie Cohen, an expert in Middle Eastern affairs. But before that, let's watch a small promo from our new series on Hamas, Hamas in your backyard. The Crusades of the thousand years ago are depicted as a Western invasion of the Middle East in order to destroy Islam. The same thing is Israel. Both Christianity and Judaism conspired in order to defeat Islam by creating something like resurrection. And this is what bogs the mind. And the first episode of the series Hamas in Your Backyard is already available on the website. Shalom to Dr. Eddie Cohen, an expert in Middle Eastern affairs. You know a Shalom. thing or two about this neighborhood. How does the Arab world see the ceasefire? How do they perceive what has happened here? Well, the Arab world, uh, they perceive it in another way other than we saw it, we see it. For example, the Arab world thinks uh, uh, that, uh, especially the young Arab, thinks that Israel uh, has, has not succeeded or Israel uh, uh, has failed in this world. And uh, uh, that's why we asked to release our hostages and uh, uh, we accepted the ceasefire. They don't see it as a, how we say, temporary ceasefire. They see it as a hudna. Hudna is an Islamic term, means a long-term ceasefire uh, that Prophet Muhammad uh, had uh, 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 1,400 years ago with his enemies. Uh, so it was a, a, a 10 years long-term ceasefire. Uh, the Arab world think that Israel has failed, that the Hamas has succeeded uh, in this war, that we have thousand or uh, thousand of Israeli soldiers killed in the we don't admit. Uh, they wow. think that, yes, they think that we have a lot of problems in the government uh, uh, between Netanyahu and Gallant and Gantz and all the uh, uh, government is about to fall. And we, they think that uh, um, we also will liberate all the uh, uh, prisoners, all the Palestinian prisoners in, in, in our jails. It's, there are about 6,000, maybe more. They think that they won. In, in two worlds, they think that they won. And they don't know that we still, you know, this now we are waiting for the release of the six uh, of, of more hostages, uh, but the Arab thinks other way. So, uh, in other words, if Israel does not resume the fighting immediately after, let's say, the 10 day period, the maximum that was decided on, then as far as the Arab world is concerned, they have tasted blood and they will want more. And this can affect how Hezbollah responds as well. Yes, you are right. You are absolutely right. More than this, they think that we will uh, accept a, a two-state solution now because we failed, because we lost the war. They think, and I see it in the social platform, in YouTube, I hear it also, they think that because we, we lost the war, now we will permit them to have their state on the 4th of June, 4 June 67 borders, East Jerusalem will be their, their capital. It's, it, it's, uh, uh, they think they, they won the war and they will get everything soon. But they don't want a state. We know that from, their, from the surveys. They want from the river to the sea. They want it all. Uh, they will start with a two-state solution. Then they will make war against Israel. This is the Arafat plan. Uh, uh, the salami. Uh, salami. The salami. Yes, yes. You get 
the uh, territory, you get uh, arms, you have a connection with Iran, you, will, you, are, you make the 7th of October, another 7th of October, and then you will buy helicopters, you will buy uh, uh, missiles, the IRC, the Iranian, will come uh, to their uh, territory. This is their plan to annihilate uh, the state of Israel. Two-state solution, it's the best way of the destruction of Israel. Many know that in Israel, that's why I'm a politician who accept this two-state solution, he, he is with the destruction of Israel. I mean, suicide. Israel National suicide. Exactly. Wow. Thank you very much, Dr. Eddie Cohen. And thank you to our viewers. I'd like to remind all our viewers not to forget to subscribe to our channels on YouTube, and Telegram, Instagram, Facebook. Shalom. The Crusades of the thousand years ago are depicted as a Western invasion of the Middle East in order to destroy Islam. The same thing is Israel. Both Christianity and Judaism conspired in order to defeat Islam by creating something like resurrection. And this is what bogs the mind.